Greetings to the Moto Vlogging community and fellow YouTubers, subscribers. Tractacular here. Out for a ride on this nice sunny fall morning. Today I am aboard Raven. That's my new 2015 Yamaha FJR 1300 ES model. Just taking some of these country back roads where there's hopefully not too much traffic. So I thought for today's topic we could discuss late night television, the talk shows. I remember years ago I was a big fan of the uh, Late Show with David Letterman. I thought he was a very funny uh, host, did pretty good interviews. I always looked forward to their top ten list. They had some great musical guests on and of course you can still see some classic uh, uh, episodes on YouTube when he had some favorite guests on. One that I really enjoyed was Don Rickles, the kind of brash comedian who, who always gave uh, uh, David Letterman a hard time but David just played along right right with him because he had a lot of respect for um, Don Don Rickles who I believe is now in his late 80s if not 90 and Johnny Carson used to um, enjoy some of his shows when he'd have on like I never saw it when Rodney Dangerfield was on as a guest but I've seen clips of it on YouTube and uh, Rodney was a, a real hit with his one-liners so I don't know if it's just my age now or but uh, the offerings now on the late night talk shows I can't really get into them uh, I was never really that big a fan of Jay Leno and his replacement I, I can't get into uh, uh, enjoying that much Jimmy Fallon I believe it is who used to be on Saturday Night Live. Um, Craig Ferguson, with, uh, that was the host of the Late Late Show, I believe it was called, he, w he was pretty funny at times. And Jimmy Kimmel has his moments. But, um, just can't seem to uh, enjoy it as much as I used to. So I'd like to hear your uh, comments um, down below in the uh, comment section. Do you still follow late night television? Some of the talk shows, the new you know, Jimmy Fallon show, or is it, or uh, is it James Colbert, the, the new host of uh, the, the David Letterman show, I understand his ratings are not very good. They've tried to revamp the, the show. So, whether it's just a, a different time in the entertainment industry, different mu musicians on now, that when you get into your mid to uh, late 50s, like 
my age, your uh, tastes in, in music and some of the entertainment offerings change, of course. Even with the new television season, been checking out some of the shows and so far uh, I haven't been impressed with any of it. Um, that new Kevin James uh, sitcom, he just seems to be yelling out uh, the whole time like he uh, needs to try decaf. And the, the new sitcom with Ted Danson and Christian Bell, where she kind of plays a character who's supposed to be dead, but I don't know. That's kind of a whitewash for me at least. So, uh, also on the new television season, have you come across any shows that you like on the major network t uh, television networks like CBS, ABC, and NBC? Some that I still enjoy watching are on the History Channel, like the American Pickers. That's kind of interesting. And once in a while, Pawn Stars. So let me know what you, you think uh, about late night television, the late night talk shows, the new television series, even some of the daytime talk shows. I, you get to the point you can't stand them, or at least I can't with that artificial applause soundtrack they have, or the artificial laughter. It's just, it seems that everyone is yelling or has to be so hyped up all the time. I think even towards the end of uh, David Letterman's show he had the uh, canned laugh track on his show where when it first started out I think they only um, recorded the real laughter and applause from the audience. So I welcome your comments. You've been watching my Tritacular channel. I hope you're able to get out and enjoy a motorcycle ride or trike or Can-Am Spider or even Polaris Slingshot ride in your area. So until next time, Take care and ride safe. Bye-bye.